hi guys welcome back to my channel so today we are gonna see how to print this pattern in Python so here indexing starts from 0 and ends with 3 that means this pattern contains 4 rows okay so uh, it starts with 0 1 2 3 so now let us see that how to code this pattern how to get this pattern using python so i'm here in jupyter notebook so first let me initialize a variable called row and let me take an input from the user so row equal to input enter the number of rows okay if you just leave it leave it here the input is uh, in string so we need to convert this input in integer type so put int and place this inside bracket inside int integer so yeah that's the input from the user now let's put a for loop for i in range row so here you need to understand a uh, range function so if the user gives input as 4 it starts from 0 comma 1 comma 2 comma 3 and set 3 so that is row minus 1 if you want it to start from start from 1 you need to give a start value as 1 and if you want it to end at 4 you need to put row plus 1 so I'm just gonna leave it leave it as 0 I'm not gonna give any initial value so yeah so that is uh, for i in range r i in range row so that starts from 0 1 2 3 if the user gives the input as 4 now let's print okay here in this figure you can see that here in the first row it contains 3 three empty spaces in the second in the in the first row it contains two in the in the second row it contains one and in the third row it contains zero so first we need to print uh, empty space and then we need to print star so print need to print empty space how many times so here i were initially i value is zero we need to give row minus i so if the row is 4 it is 4 minus 0 it is 4 times i and then we need to concat it with star so here in this figure we need to print how many times star here it is 0 we need to print 1 so that is we need to print i plus 1 times i plus one times so yeah the coding part is over now let's execute and see the result so enter the number of rows I'm gonna enter four there you go and I'm gonna try another one I'm gonna give five so there you have it this is how you print the right angle triangle reverse right angle triangle okay guys uh, that's it for today if you like this type of content consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next video until next time take care